So statistically, the two best placers currently are going to go at it. Cheap character from last game versus cheap character from this game. David B is going to join us on the mic, give us some cami knowledge. You know who that shit? Hey, Patrick, fix the stream. Come here, come here, come here, come here. How do you get rid of this? Don't um, you just, just go here. Which one? Close, close the this one. This one. Yeah, that one. You have to move the name. Okay. All right. All right. Got a button check or a restart. Yo, uh, so he's got So what do you think wins this match, Cammy? Yeah, of course you would say that. Of course you would say that. Even though you're the only one who has beaten Kevin Bong today. Um, I don't like to say Cammy's all as good as everybody says she is. Like, I yeah, agree. but that's what all top tier players say that. Yeah. Play players who play top tier characters. That's true. Patrick said, "Yeah, uh, Young wasn't as good in the last game." That's and bullshit. I swear, that I, and is, I swear, that's full blown bullshit. Back in Vanilla, I swear, fucking Okuma was the worst character in the game. Yeah, because he clearly was, right? But honestly, like in Super, I was kind of in denial. But in this game, I'm more like accepting of it, of how good she is. But right now, she was super good in Super. Yeah. I just couldn't get over like the the turtle hump, the charge character hump. Uh -huh. That's where she like had a lot of trouble. So what changed in this game that? All right, basically in AE, the reason she didn't shine as well is because Team China just overpowered her. Right. It wasn't that she sucked in AE. It was there were much cheaper characters. Exactly. And the thing that made her really good about in this game is they gave her her super. Uh, hard kick back, hard kick spiral arrow. Uh -huh. So, but the two hit one. Yeah, the two hit, which means she doesn't. When she combos near the corner, in AE she would go into the corner, and in this she doesn't. And it's FADCable now. Uh huh. And it's more damage, more stun. So that's really all she needed. And the uh, the spinning back fist is a nice little buff because it keeps you closer, so you can keep. Uh -huh. If you actually do get it to get them to block it. You can just keep pressure. I see. Oh, he drops the combo. He actually... Yeah, he could have Sako comboed him. Oh, oh what's going to happen now? Oh, he jabs his way out of it. First game. No, 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 it's 1-1. One, one. I feel for Cammy to win this, she's got to basically play as lame as possible until she gets the knockdown. Just try to jab him out of like, jab him and focus his dive kicks. I see. And just not get beat up in the footsies. You don't want to play like mid-range footsies with him. Right. But she can st still do pretty well in that. It's just something I don't like doing. Is Cammy scared of uh, Yang's setups because she is small and his his uh, forward doesn't cross up as much anymore? Yeah, uh, not really. <laughs> She's not really scared of it at all. Wrong with the first game. I don't think there's really anything too ambiguous he can do. The only thing that's like tricky that Kevin does is uh, his teleport mix up. Like stand strong and, and teleport. Uh huh. It's pretty hard. Most of the damage that Yang gets on me is like just crouch shorts, uh, crouch medium kicks. Yeah, we were stuff. just talking about this. Yang, because of how little damage he does now and how most of his setups got nerfed, he seems like a character that only does damage to you if you're scared of him. Pretty much. If you give him the space to play his game and like let him fit to you, that's pretty much the only way he's going to get damage. So who would you say, which of these characters pressures the other one harder? Cammy, easily. Because his escape options are a shitty DP and teleport, which is grabbable. So with frame traps and EX Tiger Knee and fucking, like, grab, that's all you need, and he's, like, bodied. But Kevin's doing pretty good. 
Kevin beat me 2-1 in uh, the last big two I was at. Yeah, but whatever. You body this shit 3-2 today. It's okay. Uh, I'm glad the three games that I won, I'm, I'm glad that I did it pretty dominantly, but the two games I lost, I was like, fuck. Because he kind of blew me up. Oh, that DP was unnecessary. There you go. It's a frame trap. Another thing is that <clears throat> Kami's like she's good at DPing out of that pressure. Like Yang's pressure doesn't feel too tight to me. Maybe it's just Kevin, but like sometimes I feel the openings and I just DP. Good pressure from yeah. Patrick. Ninety percent of his life is already gone, and it's over. And a convincing second game. One one. Uh, missed the crotch medium kick combo. Pat's dropping a lot of stuff. It's really important you get all your damage because every time you drop a combo against Yang, the positions reset where he can play his footsie game. Mm -hmm. Stan Ronas is pretty good in this matchup for Cammy. Right. And, I mean, it looks like it outranges his low forward. Certainly does. The thing is, though, I personally don't like relying on Roundhouse too much in this matchup because, uh, basically, he can dive kick it and get a full punish. Mm -hmm. He can also focus it, as every character can. Mm -hmm. He can jump in on it. Ooh, that should be a big combo. There it is. No respect. Yeah. <laughs> See, that's what I'm talking about. When Yang is pressuring you and he sees you blocking, he needs to spend two bars and maybe hit you two or three times. Yeah, afterwards. exactly. Bong used to just scrape my shit back in AE. Yeah. Now I have a fighting chance. Yo, Yang and AE used to give Kami major points, and that was godlike. Kevin Bong! I play Kevin all the time. Well, we used to. On, like, since, like, Super. Because he had PSN and I had PSN, and, like, PSN is fucking ass. Nobody has it. So we're always lonely. He used to play Sagat in Super, right? Yeah. He yeah. played Sagat in Vanilla and Super. He played a lot of characters in Super. Because it was out for so long. Like, yeah. even I was, like, trying to play Rose. You know, when we were first taking signups for the league, and Bong was deciding whether to use Sagat or, or Yang, I was like, Sagat, Sagat, Sagat. Yeah, I wanted, Sagat. I, I wanted to see him play I wanted, Sagat. I wanted to beat him. Sagat, Sagat. I love it. For a while, it looked like it was going to be Sagat. Yeah. And it was like, nah, stay free. I'm going to pick Yang. Too many drop combos from Patrick right now. He needs to hit confirm better. Oh, now, good attempt. Off of the back throw, Cammy's is a 50-50 against Yang, right? All the time. Against everyone, pretty Against much. everyone, yeah. She can do so much off that back throw that it's a chip victory. That's one of the things that makes Cammy so dangerous, that if you manage to block her frame traps, you leave yourself exposed to throws. And off that back throw, she's fucking phenomenal. And she gets cross uh, unblockables on certain characters. Yeah. Like Akuma. Akuma, re pretty much all Shotos, plus a handful of others. <clears throat> oh. Yeah, that's not a good thing when you see uh, that medium punch come out. That means he was going for a close medium punch. Mm -hmm. He could have comboed off it, but he definitely wasn't expecting that. That crouch forward is really good in this matchup as well. Yeah, it beat out Yang's crouch forward, yeah. which I as a character have never been able to do. <laughs> yeah. 
But it's kind of like, it's back and forth. They can both outputs to each other with that medium pick. It's a matter of how it's done. Oh, good bait. Good punish. It's immediate damage. Uh oh, counter hits that up. All right, Not what's gonna come from either. this? Dives himself into the corner. Ooh, just DP style. Nice reaction. That's good shit. I Although I think he was just walking up and just doing a DP and seeing if he can FEDC, oh, and then just auto corrected him. Feeling. And he pulls it off. Yo, two two. Come on, Kevin. Don't go out like that. Not again. Nah, fuck Kevin. <laughs> <laughs> fuck Cammy. Just kidding. I love you. Oh, good combo. One of the things that's important in this uh, matchup, like, you notice Kevin sometimes after his spiral arrow combo, since Cammy has the 50-50, he chooses to not quick stand. Yeah, I've tried that, and then it just seems like she can just jump again and then spiral arrow you. Exactly. So basically, it's good and bad. It depends on whether or not the Cammy player recognizes it. Like, sometimes they catch me, and I'm like, shit, I wasn't ready for them to not quick stand. But other times, I'm like, all right, I'll just reset. Is that dead? Uh, I no, I think, he, he, I think he's going to live. Really? Yep. Did you, yep. Oh, I didn't see what led to it. Ooh! Gutsy EX command grab. Yeah. With meter, he had two bars to DP FADC Ultra. He didn't even need to, but... Another thing I noticed in this matchup, Cammy can, if Yang goes for like regular uh, command throw, Cammy can just crouch tech and it beats it. So that's why he went for EX. In the corner. Oh, dirty. Drops the combo though. Back throw. Are the setups the same if you're in the corner off of a back throw? Pretty much. It depends on what setup. Like the unblockables, I'm uh, not too sure to be honest. But as far as the cannon strike mix-ups, they're all pretty much. It's all about the spacing. Last round. Down to the wire. Oh, no respect. Dude. Kevin Bong doesn't care. If Kevin keeps this momentum, he doesn't care. He's gonna get the round, unless Cammy makes a big comeback. Oh, oh, I can't drop that. Drops a you combo. Cannot drop that. He's definitely he went for the soccer combo, and it's good to go optimal. But sometimes just medium, medium is good enough because that knockdown is so beneficial. Kevin was a little hesitant to get go in there. And now he's on the one on the defensive. Double back dash. Uh oh. Oh, he could have altered. He could have FADC altered. That's a wrap. Or maybe not. Kevin's got a bike. Come on. Come on, Kevin. Oh, oh, that's it. Man. Good shit. It's a very good match. Very good match. Kevin goes undefeated to everyone but Cammy. FYI. Yeah, good so shit, fuck Cammy.